Welcome back if you're a fan of the channel and hey welcome if you're new here and in today's video I'm bringing you guys another deck from 151 and today we're gonna be looking at Jinx EX. Jinx EX is in my opinion a very silly deck. Uh, I actually saw this on Twitter with Jinx, a Jinx EX and I thought you know what let's let's make it let's let's see what we could do. I think there's some other fun decks that I want to check out like Blastoise that I think is going to be pretty might might be competitively viable but this one was just a little bit too fun to not try. Uh, so uh, Jinx EX has Heart Stopping Kiss uh, which could be the main attack that we're using if your opponent if your active pokemon uh if your opponent's active pokemon is asleep then it is knocked out which is pretty good you don't need to really worry about hitting for 300 plus if the if it's asleep it's knocked out so we have some sport pokemon to be able to do that and the one that i think is really really cool is this venusaur from the pokemon go series it has loopy lasso once during your turn, you flip a coin. If it's heads, you switch your opponent's bench Pokemon with their active, and now the new active Pokemon is now asleep. So not only, and it's poison, not only are we putting an active Pokemon to sleep, we're actually pulling something in off the bench. So Charizard's uh, something, some EX2 prizer we can pull onto the bench asleep, have Jinx in the active with the pro with the proper energy on it, and go ahead and uh, just take a KO. So we do need to hit a coin flip, but that's, uh, you know, it's that's not too bad. We'll take that. We'll take those odds. Now, on top of that, we are also running this Hypno from 151, who, which has the ability here for Hypnosis. When this Pokemon uh, evolves from my hand, you uh, may put the active Pokemon to sleep. So we can use this as a guaranteed way to get uh, Pokemon to sleep, but it is only a one-off. We are only running two. So he's kind of just, you know, get Drowsy on the bench. If we have the option, we don't hit heads. We go ahead and we evolve it. And then we go ahead and we put him to sleep and take the KO. Uh, on top of that, we are running Greninja, a uh, Bidoof Bid Barrel for some draw engine. And then... We have some Nest Balls, Ultra Ball, Switch Carts. We are playing three Path to the Peak, and I'm playing Path because I want to be able to shut off my opponent's abilities. Uh, we don't really care too much about our abilities. Greninja is the only one that we will shut off, so uh, I think that this is a really cool card to play. A lot of hand disruption. And then energy-wise, four DTEs and six Water Energy. Water Energy a little bit higher, um, which we don't really need, but um, I think it's to be able to use Greninja, and then we also want to be able to attach that one Water Energy on to Jinx. So... Let me know what you guys think of this deck. I think, like I said, it's it's a little it's a little silly. It, it's got a little potential to be a little meme-y, but I, I think it's I think it's fun. Uh, we're gonna play some games. We're gonna check it out. But if you guys are new here, I'm giving away a booster box at 1K subs. You can find the link in the description. So go check that out. Uh, and while you're down there, go ahead, hit subscribe, hit the like button. Let me know what you think of 151. Uh, I want to know what you pulled, what decks you're excited to play. Just Go ahead and give me all your thoughts. So let's go find some games. We hit Tails. We have the option to go first. We are going to go first. We want to set up Bulbasaur and Jinx as quick as humanly possible. Maybe a Drowsy too. And uh, end up a Barrel. A uh, Bidoof if we can find it. Um, fire deck. I feel like whenever I'm playing uh, on the uh, casual ladder, we see Fire decks and Charizards. Yeah. But we will see a Charizard Wallace. Draw three cards. Your opponent may draw a card. Okay. I've not seen that before. But with Path of the Peak, I think that this is actually a pretty good pretty good deck for us to battle the peas. Ooh, love it. Um, our opponent mulled again again. They have one. Uh, I can see. But Okay, research. We have a rare candy. I would like to find an Ultra Ball somewhere, but if we need to, uh, you know, if we need to, we need to. But we should have our whole bench set up on the next turn, so on turn one, so that feels good. Let's see what we get off this. Another DTV. Okay. Oh. Turn two, we can definitely get two DTEs attached. A second rare candy. Let's go ahead and uh, drop that. We will Bidoof Bulbasaur. And then I think we grab a Drowsy Jinx. And maybe we leave this slot open. Uh, we could drop another Drowsy, but I think we leave it open. Let's, uh, let's drop that on the Jinx. Maybe we pull the Venusaur and we get to use two rare candies. I kind of don't want to throw away the rare candies, if I'm being honest. Because um, then we... Will, or actually, I think I'm only running two. So we might have to hold on to these. We might have to hold on to them. Um, so let's see what happens. We'll end our turn. See what we get off the top draw. So. God, if we can get Path down, that'd be really good. Prevent the Infernal Rain from coming out. Uh, let's see how quick they're able to get set up. Oh. This also might be the first time I'm doing a video with no glasses on. I'm wearing my contacts, which I usually don't do. I usually don't wear contacts, but uh, I went for a run today uh, before I filmed, and I forgot to put them on. I forgot to take them out. But so yeah, little little different look today. But I'm more of a glasses guy. I prefer the glasses over the contacts, especially because I stare at a screen all day. Uh, just just makes it easier. Just makes it easier. Okay, Ultra Ball from our opponent. 
I'd imagine they're going to pick up... Oh, the dude. Okay. I was going to say another Charmander, but... I've also seen this deck run... Um, we get... Uh, we're just going to go into the Jinx because I have another DT. I've seen this deck also run... Um, Arcanine. But three cards in hand doesn't look like they have what they want. It's going to pass to us. Oh, the Venusaur! Sick! Okay, so we can use the rare candy. We get the Venusaur. That's a crazy. That's crazy good. Now we could research. We don't care. Uh, we get Path. Oh, we get the Water Energy. We get the Barrel. That was a crazy good. Okay. Um, we drop Ninja. We can't attach. Right, 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 right. We can't attach. We can't attach. Um. Drop Ninja. Maybe we save the coin flip. We drowsy. Oh no, we can't drowsy. We can't get a kill. We can't get a kill this turn. No kill this turn. Um, do I save the energy though? I probably, I probably just save the energy. I probably just save the energy. Um, let's let's drop Greninja. Maybe maybe we can switch card. We'll just switch card. We're gonna use some cards here. We want to play path. Let's go ahead and be barrel. Maybe we get a second water energy. No, we don't. Um, okay. All right. We're going to keep the Ultra Ball. We have two battle VIP passes to flip with it. Um, we're just going to loopy lasso. I think you should, I think we just do this every turn because if we hit heads, which we don't, we would pull the Charmander out. We'd put it to sleep and we'd poison it. And it, that gives us the chance to potentially have a keep, like, you know, you got to flip a coin to, to, to see if you stay asleep or not. So even if we don't get it, we uh, we still can, you know, even if we can't KO it, we still could could uh, could delay them a turn. Now, evolving uh, does reset that, so that's probably something to, to keep in mind. Uh, and now we have two options here, two options. We should attach the water energy for sure, uh, and then we're gonna loopy lasso. If we take the Charmeleon, we take the Charmeleon. That's cool. Heads, kills. Unfortunate, unfortunate. So not the end of the world. Uh, we can just Ultra Ball here, and we can grab this Hypno, and Hypno will will take the Bidoof. Uh, we wanted to kind of pull in the pull in the the Charmeleon, prevent it from a Charizard, but that's okay. We have Path down, so I'm I'm not too pressed. And we'll pull Industrious and Scissors for three. Another Jinx, Bosses, Judge. Don't think we need to judge. I get uh no, I get, well, we didn't know we were gonna get it, so that's okay. That's okay. Let's take the KO. Heart stopping kiss. Just give Bidoof a little smooch, and uh, we send it to the discard pile <laughs> and uh oh water energy six so we have another jinx ready to go uh i guess we can't use loopy lasso oh if there's no one on the bench that's tricky that's tricky that might be how you beat this deck just never bench anything just don't bench <laughs> um that's unfortunate maybe we could hit collapsed and like kick off Hypno or something. I don't know. I don't know. Yeah, I'm guessing Loopy Lasso isn't going to work here. We do get drowsy. Yeah, Loopy Lasso will not work. Um. Hmm. We get Judge. Let's Judge. Let's Judge. Why not? Right? Why not? We get the Water Energy, which we probably should put here. Um. Go ahead and industrious. Yeah, but yeah, we we definitely didn't need uh definitely didn't need. Just give it give him a smooch anyway. <clears throat> definitely didn't need Greninja here. Probably should have just put Drowsy, and then we could have just got a hypno and then taken this KO, but it's okay. It's okay, he's gonna hit us for 180. I guess as long as he doesn't bench anything, we don't have an out here, is that what it feels like right just never benches we have to go and find uh go find our water energy is that what we need might be what we need um actually no because we can get drowsy and go into drowsy so let's 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 offer up greninja as our sacrifice oh what did i do that for oh no that's okay we'll, we'll have to wait a turn uh it's industrious by Ono. Oh we have the ball. We have the ball. Yeah, we probably just get drowsy. Find a hypno. Is it in the discard? No. Okay. Yeah, why did I do that? <laughs> why did I do that? 
<laughs> There's a Growlithe. Nice, we could Loopy Lasso something. Cool. That feels good. Um, and like we can Loopy Lasso, get the Growlithe out, sleep, lock it in that position, and then like Loopy Lasso to bring out Charizard and then kill it. That's, <laughs> I think that's the play. Oh, actually we could Escape Robe and then Loopy Lasso. Oh, that feels good. Who's he gonna come in on? He's gonna come in onto the Jinx. Our poor Jinx. Our poor Jinx. We do need to hit heads here, though. We do need to hit heads. Our opponent's had two prizes. Heads, heads is gonna be big. Heads is gonna be big. We're gonna have to escape rope into the, into the, uh, into the heads. That's what we need. Uh, let's go ahead and nest ball. Let's get ourselves the drowsy. Let's just make sure that we have the hit. We do. We do. Okay, so we have some, we have a couple outs. We have a couple outs. Um, escape rope. Come on, Loopy Lasso, one time for us. Game is... Oh, right, sorry. Game's bugged, I... it's gonna bug the game. Loopy Lasso. Yes, hits the heads. We find the Charizard, we put it to sleep. We have the KO. Um, I think we I don't know, put him down to two cards, make this a little bit harder uh, for our opponent. We don't need to use that water energy. Path is still down. Um, two cards for our opponent. We have an Ultra Ball to be able to get a Hypno next turn. Uh, Heart Slap and Kiss. KO a Charizard, 330, right to the face. Nice. It was a little, it, it was a little unorthodox the way that it worked, but we, we got it. We got it. Um, Clap Stadium. We had bosses. Um, so, okay. All right. We're, we're feeling good. We're feeling good. No, tar, uh, no Charmanders on the bench. Probably Loopy Lasso, get rid of the Growlithe, and then we save this Drowsy for whatever's in the active. That's I think that's the cleanest play that we have right now. Three prizes. If we see this become an Arcanine, this is like really good for us. If this becomes an Arcanine, this is like best case scenario. If this is a Charmander, we probably go into the Charmander. Yeah, we probably we probably go into the Charmander. Unless this starts to stack energy. Let's see where the energy goes. I mean, he can't infernal. He can't infernal, right? Um, let's go ahead and loopy lasso. Hails. Oof. 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 Okay. Um, we probably want the KO this turn, and I think we probably stack some water energy onto Jinx. Now that I'm thinking about it, because we can icy wind on the next turn on one of these if we need to. Like, say we can't. Um, hit it, but I think we go ahead and we get rid of the Bulbasaur, and let's get her a research. Let's keep the bosses. Let's go ahead and grab, hit, grab Hypno, put the Bidoof to sleep, and then we're just looking for we're looking for a uh, an EX or a V Pokemon to, uh, you know, Loopy Lasso and call it, call it a night. Heart Slapping Kiss, take our fourth prize, two prizes left. We're in pretty good shape. I think we're in good shape here. A judge could be useful. Could be useful. Yeah, I think if we find one more water energy. Um, there's the rare candy. There's the Charizard. So we need to boss the Growlithe and hit a Loopy Lasso. That's what we need. Can he give it to us? Even if he doesn't, we have a we have a I have a couple shots at this. Let's see if we hit it. Loopy Lasso, one time. Hits it. Let's go. Give us the Charizard. Put it to sleep. Heart stopping kiss for the win. <laughs> I just think I think it's so I think it's so silly. I think it's like this the funniest. I don't know. I think it's hilarious. I think it's hilarious. Especially against Charizard. Especially against Charizard because it has so much HP. Nice. All right. We, we take a win. Uh, that felt good. Let's go ahead and let's find another match. That is a pretty cool uh, Genesect coin. I don't think I've seen that before. And they hit Tails. So we will get to go first. Which we like going first. We, we appreciate it. To, you know, we appreciate going first. Um, hopefully we can get a turn to attack. How sick would that be? That is a mulligan. That's a that's a hard mulligan. That's a hard mulligan. 
So the issue with this deck that I found is that we don't have a backup attacker. Not really. We have no really source of backup, you know, uh, attacking in any way. So kind of is the issue with the deck. Um, but when it hits, it hits. You know what I mean? It feels good. Feels good. We're gonna use the Nest Ball. We're gonna grab a Jinx. We have the Hypno Play, and we have also Luminion. So stop! Stop! You're joking. You are joking. There's no possible way that someone else is playing Jinx EX. Stop. That is so funny. That is so funny. This is gonna be a really interesting. <laughs> It's going to be a really interesting match. No way. Okay, well, let's see what our opponent built. Um, Bulbasaur, of course. Of course. The Loopy Lasso. That. <laughs> I think that, that that's, that is really funny. Um, okay. So, this is going to be just an interesting matchup of who can get people set up to, to take... Uh, you know, put put you to sleep. I guess. I guess going into Bulbasaur is maybe the better solution. Two Bulbasaur. Okay. Go deep into the Loopy Lasso. You know what I mean? Go big on it. Why not? Uh, search your deck for three evolution Pokemon that don't have rule boxes. Oh, that would, that's a good that's a good card to have in this. It would get you Hypno. It would get you. Okay. All right. See. We're learning something new about this deck. Very cool. Very cool. It's a good card to have. Luminion for Azu. That's cool. Okay. Starbato over here hitting us with a hitting us with some knowledge. Stage two Pokemon for free retreat. This guy's got everything up his sleeve. Um. Okay. I think we just Iono here. I don't like my hand. There's no point in Jinx EX. We would have to hit a DT and an Escape Rope. Yeah, we don't hit it. We just don't. We don't hit it. Uh, let's go and grab Bulbasaur. Get the doof up next turn, and then we could. Uh... Unless we retreat into Jinx now, that would stop the Loopy Lasso. Let's do it. Get into Jinx. That prevent Loopy Lasso from coming in and hitting Jinx, and I think we we like that. We like that. We like that a lot. Uh, get the barrel going. We'll hit a Judge. Uh, judge and then Bebero? Bebero then Judge? I don't know. Not sure what the proper proper play is here, but he's working it towards it. Working towards the Loopy Lasso. There's a water energy. Okay, so next turn we could have the DTE, but also so could we. We could have we could have a a, a, a hypno play into a DTE, so I feel good. I do like the air balloon here on the, the stage two and over tree cost. Research is away a rare candy. A third Bulbasaur. You get a fourth ball before I'm gonna scream. <laughs> My friend, that's way too many Bulbasaurs. I guess you can. Can you do multiple of the Loopy Lassos? Uh, I get the. I get it. I guess I should. I guess I should run it and see if I hit the rare candy. Let's see. We don't. We do not. Uh, do we collapse? We collapse one of these Bulbasaurs. Wait, get out of here. Get out of here, Bulbasaur. Kick away one of them. Let's go ahead and judge. Let's see if we can get something going. Oh, we just can't. We just can't. We should drop this jinx and water energy. Research. I don't I mean I don't want to research away the Venusaur, but I guess we have the option to the barrel here. But yeah, can you can you multiple loopy lasso? I went for a 2-2 line to just like there it is. Uh, I went for a 2-2 line to just go ahead and like be able to hit on it, really. Um, here's the Loopy Lasso. It's a battle of Loopy Lassos, bro. I, I can't. I can't. I think that is so funny. But we still have the play to hit Drowsy here. Uh, so maybe we do just research. Actually, I think we have the Barrel and then research. I think that's probably the better play. That's, that's the better play. There's a Water Energy. Uh, let's attach the Water Energy. And maybe that's a mistake. If I hit a DT, I'm going to be mad. Okay, we don't hit a DT. I feel less bad about it. Um, do we go ahead and get a hypno off of this? We can't. We can't get a KO. 
So what's the point? Yeah, what's the, what does that get us? I'm gonna get rid of one of the Venusaurs. Get a second Venusaur. We're just missing. We're just missing. Uh, we're gonna grab this Venusaur back. The water energy. I might as well, might as well grab your energy anyway. Uh, we're just missing a, a rare candy and one more water energy, and then we're we're feeling good. Feeling really good. Uh, and we have the Ultra Ball to be able to find Hypno. Uh, okay, one water energy. And we're good. We're sitting pretty. We need we bosses. We could boss up the other Jinx, maybe. Actually, that, I like that play. Especially if we find the rare candy, I really like that play. Oh, they have the energy. Here's the Rupee Lasso, people. This is it. Tails. Yes, Tails. <laughs> Oh, this matchup is so, it's so dumb. There's the boss's orders. Okay, we have a switch cart. So, oh, he's gonna kill our Bulbasaur. No, that's so mean. That's, that is incredibly rude of you, Jinx. Uh, let's go to this Jinx. We still have Drowsy if we need it. Get I, oh no. Um... Okay, I think we, I think we do this. I think we do this. I think we get the drowsy. I right, we get the hit now. And I'm feeling good on the odds of hitting a research here and getting this KO. That is what I feel good on. Let's do here for hypnosis. Put Jinx to sleep. Uh, let's research. Gets the gets the third energy, which feels really good. Let's get another Jinx on the bench. Three battle VIP passes is, is, is a little concerning, but our right, stopping kiss gets us a kill. Maybe I saved this spot for uh, Bulbasaur, maybe, or Drowsy, maybe, maybe. But we also do IC win now, so I'm not too pressed. There's a DTE, so we can get the second Jinx up and running. We just need to find some solution uh, for uh, putting Pokemon to sleep, and I probably we probably need to kick off collapsed at some point. And maybe maybe our opponent will do it for us. There's a Bulbasaur. Which we can take that kill. We also can just boss up Jinx. Be the best play, boss up Jinx, and then just just keep smacking him in the face with icy wind, which is like, get I oh no no! I had the DTE for once. I actually have it. Four cards. Oh, we do get another drowsy. Cool. Except uh, I think we need to judge. I think we need to judge. So I need I need a I need a path. Have I, have I used any of my paths? No. Yeah, we want path. It'll turn off. It'll turn off for ninja for them. Also, bumps bumps out. Uh, oh, nice. They did it for us. Sick. And it's poke stop. Ultra ball, water energy, and Erica's invitation. Even though I really want to drop Bulbasaur here, maybe we should. Maybe we should ultra ball Bulbasaur. Yeah, we should. We should. We should ultra ball Bulbasaur. That's what we should do. We can take the KO on this Bulbasaur. We get Bulbasaur here, and then we focus on getting uh, the other Venusaur, which we know is in the deck. So we don't have bosses. We have bosses. I guess we could Luminion, but I still, I still think I like this spot for. And we had a second Jinx. Yeah, yeah, I like this spot. I like this spot for Bulbasaur. Hypno, you did your job. Here comes Luffy Lasso. It does hit. It's gonna come into this Jinx, I'd imagine. Yep. So we don't have the KO anymore. So we need a uh, we need an escape rope. Escape rope would be would be ideal. I still do like maybe maybe hitting Pokestop. Ultra Ball. Yeah, we do need to hit an escape rope. Have I used it? I have not used it. Okay. Stays asleep. Uh, there's Luminion, but I think we're going to judge that away. Let's go ahead and kick out... Maybe we keep Drowsy, maybe we drop Luminion. Grab Bulbasaur, still have the Venusaur, so we like that. Let's judge. Looking for an escape rope here. We don't find it. We do find this combo, which I guess is a little bit annoying. Let's go ahead and Pokestop. Just don't kick away DTEs. That's <laughs> terrible. That's terrible. What? <laughs> I, I, okay. Uh, uh, okay. <laughs> I can't do anything with this hand now. 
just have to let this jinx die, I guess. Jeez. It could just continually loopy lasso us. And we're just stuck in this purgatory. But we do shot off Greninja for them. Uh, never mind, there's Pokestop. I feel like we just need to keep Pokestopping. Unless, unless, uh, oh, he just threw away everything he's ever owned. Artifax, I guess that makes sense. You're going to run like a, uh, you know, way to get energy in. I think I like putting down Freebacks instead of running four Bulbasaur like he did. But it is an interesting take on the deck. Uh, part of me does wish I had this Drowsy, but... What, are we just going to kill a Bulbasaur? Does make sense. With Loopy Lasso, though, we do run the risk of just, like, getting stuck in this position, so... Just passes it back to us. We stay asleep. What is up with that? What is up with that? Our turn now. We do get bosses. Let's see what we hit on this magical focus op. There's the escape rope. Lost our Venusaur, which feels bad. Which does feel bad. Um, Loopy Lasso might just get us back into this position. But let's escape rope. I think we might just take this KO with Icy Wind, put us at three prizes, and then we have bosses. We, we ran out of Venusaurs, so we probably want to sack our Bulbasaur at some point so we can get Drowsy in and pick up another two prizes that way. But let's hold on to bosses. If we want a boss, we, we can figure out a boss situation. Might need to drop Lucy. We might need to find a way to, to kill this Venusaur, and that, that might be Drowsy into... Drowsy into... Uh, into something here. So, I don't know if they, they play DTEs. I think that's the that's the awkward part. Have I not seen any? I saw I saw one DTE for like half a second. You're telling me there's four DTEs in here? I guess I'm gonna be surprised, but like still, it's like a one in four chance that we pull it next. How many like Ionas and judges have I used? I'm running three Ionas, three two judges. One judge, one Iono, two Ionos, two judge. Okay, so we have one Iono left, possibly. Just threw away everything. He's just chucking away water energy. It's not gonna be Frigabax. Frigabax, rare candy, Bax Caliber to just absolutely cook me. Oh, nothing there. I would actually love to see this list. I wanna know what what list this is. Like, this is interesting to me. It does have Miriam to be able to get some of the, these Pokemon back that he's throwing away, but... Oh, there's the rare candy on the Venusaur. So, okay, now I'm curious to see. Can he Loopy Lasso twice here? Does he have two chances at it? Fails the first. I'm waiting for it to go again. Second Loopy Lasso. Okay, so maybe, maybe running more Venusaurs is the move. Maybe that's the play. He's going to pick up our boy Jinx here, who's hurt. And we might just lose this Jinx to Poison. That, that <laughs> might, might just be what happens. It might take forever. But it is our turn. Okay. Uh, We don't need anything. We're just going to be wasting cards. Uh, us hit him with Path. We're low on energy here. I need a DTE. I need to not be asleep and then DTE out into, into Jinx. It's kind of where we're at right now. Okay. Stay asleep. He's up. Jinx is up. Like, do you Lucy La do you loopy lasso here? Is that what you do? Is that the play? I guess technically if it stays like this, we just lose, <laughs> I guess. But um I think I think we can drowsy. He does. He's gonna loopy lasso. Oh, what do you, who do you go for here? Bulbasaur is a dead card for me. And does he not have energy? I have so many questions. So many questions. This one's on fire. Just always hit heads. But yeah, this is the move, people. This is the move. Puts it back into our hand. Okay. Interesting. 
Is he a solar beam? <laughs> or is he gonna try to retreat? Is that what he's gonna do? He's gonna try to retreat. We wake up. Okay, so we just need a DTE. We get a DTE, we can we can retreat out here. There it is. There's our DTE. Um But what do we go into? Like this is where it gets complicated here. We go into Jinx, right? And then we what? Smack his Venusaur? Her and we just pray he misses both Loopy Lassos. Like that's gotta be the that's gotta be the play, right? Just pray that he hits Tails twice on Loopy Lasso. It's gotta be the move. Go ahead and hit an icy wind. <laughs> 120. If we take down one Venusaur, we make ourselves feel better. Oh, he's asleep, right? Stay asleep. Yes. Okay. Only one Loopy Lasso. Only one Loopy Lasso. Okay. Okay. We're good. We're good. He's gonna miss this Loopy Lasso, and we're gonna be fine. I've said the word Loopy Lasso way too many times. Oh, we can still use Loopy Lasso through sleep? I clearly don't put Pokemon to sleep enough to know that you can use abilities through that. I, I thought I thought for sure. Come on. It's this one doesn't miss. This one misses. This one doesn't. What's up with that? Come on. Well, we have bosses order to take that kill, but if we need it. And we have we should have more DTEs. We should have at least a couple more DTEs. So if we wake up, we can we can finish off this kill. <laughs> we can finish off this this one and and only have to worry about one loopy lasso and then just use our DTEs to continually get out of these positions. That's 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 the that's the goal. Another energy here is bad. Probably really bad actually. Wakes up. Hit me with a DTE. Come on. Oh, they, he wakes up oh, two different. Okay. What about all VIP passes in hand? What is up with that? Uh, I guess I'll attach that there to the Jinx. And then we'll end the turn. Um, you know, we I think we just need to lose this 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 Jinx. This Jinx just needs to go. It just needs to go. This has been the most wild matchup I've ever been a part of. I can't believe someone else is playing this other incredibly silly deck. Oh, he's switching up here. This Luby Lasso goes first. It misses. Okay. Second one. He probably has another energy. Two misses. Let's go. He puts another energy. We just got saved. Irida. Irida is a, probably a really good card in this deck. Now that I'm thinking about it. Irida is probably a really, really good card. Um, because you can get your rare candy, and you could find, like, Jinx, or you could find, you know, you're just probably a really good card, I'm thinking about it. He's gonna get a third Bulbasaur? A Venusaur? Don't do that. Don't, buddy, buddy, don't do that. We don't, we don't need three Luby Lassos. We just don't. We, we just don't need it. I need to go for the icy wind here, and then we need to just hope we can figure out a solution to kill this Jinx and take the take the last prize card. <laughs> oh my god! Yo, oh, we get the DDE. That's sick. Okay, we need to survive possibly two Loopy Lassos. That's where that's where we're currently at. If he has a second, we got rid of one, but can we survive a second <laughs> Loopy Lasso? Please. Yes, he missed. Thank you. Okay, we save our DTE for another day. We can hold on to it. We have like eight turns to get this done. Here's a boss. He's going to do it the old-fashioned way. How many DTEs have we gone through? I think we have one more DTE. We have one more opportunity. Goes into Bulbasaur. Interesting. Okay. We get the switch card. Oh, switch card is a savior of a card. Give us the boss. Let's go ahead and hit Icy Wind. And even if we survive... Okay, unless he evolves here. Unless he evolves. Oh, he woke up. Well, it doesn't matter because we hit for 240. doesn't matter. So unless he evolves and hits two Loopy Lassos, I think we have it no matter what. Unless we get Iono, I think we have it. <laughs> this game has been insane. Look, you think of mirror matches being hard to play against, and no one, no one ever thinks double jinx where you just have to continually put Pokemon to sleep. No one. 
but somehow I'm playing it right now. Somehow I'm playing it. I need to wake up. I just realized that. I need to wake up. I need to wake up. GG's. So many coin flips this game. I can't wait to see at the end of the game, at the, the end of the screen, when it says like coin flips and all that, how many we just went through because, geez, what a battle. But I win the Jinx EX Mirror match. I do say, I will say, I think he has the better deck. I think he has the better deck than me. <laughs> I think Drowsy did come up clutch, but I think he has the better deck. So, GG's to Viabar. That was, thank you for sticking through that wild matchup. 600 damage, 120 damage done. Four coin flips won. He won a seven. Kid was hitting two loopy lassos a turn. Insane. Insane matchup. <laughs> if you watched to the end of this video, thank you so much for watching. I hope you enjoy the craziest mirror match that you maybe have ever seen in Pokemon Trade Card Game Life history. Hit the subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next week.